This is Matt Allington and I'm just recording this short video to show you the end-to-end -end process of how uh, small businesses can use Power BI Premium. So this is the basic process. So we're going to use Microsoft Flow to start up my premium capacity, which is an A1 SKU in this case. Once the capacity is started, we're going to assign um, one of my workspaces to that premium capacity and then I'll demonstrate it working. So first of all, here we are, there's Power BI. This is my workspace. And let me just jump into this workspace and we'll have a look at the users. And I've got a few people here and I'm going to So add that. So now my test user has access to this site. Now I've got my test user set up on a guest browser. So this is um, a guest browser, so there's no other tokens or anything. I've logged in as my guest user. And if I come here and try to access the SharePoint test, you'll say it says try for free. So this is confirmation that I don't have a pro account on this test user. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch over to my main account and come and have a look at the Azure SKU. So here's my dashboard, here's my demo, and you can see that it's currently paused. And you saw before that there is no premium capacity here. Come over to my flow, I'm going to run my flow. have a look at it running. It takes about 30 seconds to complete the flow, mainly in the resuming of the SKU. Okay, all done. We'll go back to here and just do a refresh. So it's now active. We come over here and do a refresh. It's now premium. We switch to my other browser and I go to the test site. This is my test user with no pro account and it's working.